What is up guys, Johnny here, back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, we look at the Madfinger Games 9 year anniversary event. We look at all the rewards, including a brand new legendary AR. And we look at the missions, how to get there. And I will give you guys all the tips you need to get there fast and make sure you get that auto rifle before the two weeks event ends. Now the event started yesterday. We did have a little bit of information before the event, but not much. They wanted to keep it secret and let us discover by ourselves. So we were not sure before the event if it was going to be nine different chains of quests or one long chain of nine quests. So it is nine missions, one long chain quest, nine missions. You can only do one mission at a time. And when you're done, you get your reward and you can start the next mission. So you cannot work on multiple missions at once. It will start automatically when you get into the game. You get your first mission, which is kill 500 torment. You need to get 500 kills. It could be a bit of a grind, but I'll give you guys tips. So let's look at the list of missions first. I will give you guys the tips and then we'll look at the rewards at the end. Now here's the list. Like I said, first one is get 500 kills. Uh, there's not much to it. You just need to kill stuff. But if you want to kill lots of enemies quick, do arenas, guys. Bronze arena easier than silver maybe there's a bit more enemies in silver so we did it on stream we had to do three silvers and one bronze and we were all done with the 500 kills so when you're done you talk to slate is going to give you your first reward and then you can start the next one do 10 co-op missions and i get a lot of questions what is a co-op exactly well co-op missions means you have to do the operation missions to start a co-op mission you have to go on the planets and click on your missions that are available on the map so the quick way to do 10 is squad up with a friend and then you can start playing back to back to back missions without waiting if you just do launch co-op it's gonna search for a co-op partner and you're gonna waste a bit of time and you're gonna be matched with a random partner. So it's gonna take a bit more time, but I suggest take a friend and do 10 in a row. It takes a minute, two minutes per operation if you get easy ones. And uh, yeah, it's pretty quick. Now the next mission is get 30 kills with skills. Now, again, I get questions about that. How? Do you get kills with skills or what exactly is a kill with skills? Well, I will show you real quick. To do kills with skills, you need to use these skills, active skills that will actually kill enemies. The best skill in the game to do that is definitely AM bomb. It will kill a lot of trash mobs at once. So go bronze arena or silver arena once again with AM bomb. And when it's ready, throw it in a pack. You'll get five plus kills every time you use AM bomb. So you need 30 kills to do this mission. Now as a second skill, you could go with grenades. It's got a short cooldown. You can spam grenades in arenas and get extra kills with that. You can use sentry gun if it's available on your skill tree. And that's pretty much it. These are the best three skills in my opinion to do kills with skills. Now, after you're done with your 30 kills, it's not exactly the right words, but we said kill 10 yellow dudes. Basically, it's kill anything that is not gray. So yellow, orange, red guys, uh, do silver arena. That's what we did. One silver arena run, we all had our 10 kills. So the twin blades, the chargers, the crushers, everything that's yellow. And there's a lot of yellows in silver arena. Go for it, get the kills, and you're done. Now, the mission five is get 3,000 damage in PvP. It can be duels, can be team PvP, but I suggest you go in team. You'll see more enemies. You don't need to win. You don't need to kill people. Just shoot people, get damage, and it will take you three, four, five games maybe. If you're really good, probably you'll be done in two games maybe, but it took me three games, I think. In, uh, I think we had elimination today three games we were done so yeah shoot people get 3000 damage and claim your reward mission six is kill a boss now what is a boss regis blade dancer at the end of the dungeons if you want to do it easy guys do brothers of fire it's like four minutes and there's two boss at the end but you only need to kill one of the brothers of fire to make it count and we did it on stream confirmed by other guys it does work so mission six the easy way to do it brothers of fire now here's the grind guys mission seven is get 50,000 fame now i will post a link in the description for a video i made a few events ago we had to grind fame in another event uh basically get a fame boost 
and speed farm brothers of fire i will also post my brothers of fire speed farming guide in the description so it's all you need watch my video how to farm fame but yeah keep an eye on hakim missions so you can do it at the same time as you farm dungeons the weapon missions are pretty quick every time you finish sell your weapons to willow because you got the selling missions from willow it's extra fame also and every time you're done with five you get a big boost five thousand fame uh one more thing guys while we do mission one two three four five six if you get big chunks of fame don't claim it keep it for mission seven get a fame boost and claim all your fame also keep an eye for your daily missions it's big chunks of fame now mission eight if you guys are already 20 or level 20 plus it's automatic you get a reward and get to mission nine straight up now mission nine is the last one and that's the one that will give you the legendary weapon you need to do no death in the arena the whole squad need to survive so do bronze arena guys it's the easiest of all three don't go silver i know maybe you can do it but if you just want to do untouchables go for bronze now med kit deflector skin if you want to cheat that or try to stay alive in a tough spot med kit deflector skin will help you guys stay alive now let's look at the rewards now the very first reward you'll get is the mfg eye patch it's not a secret you'll see it when you enter the game your first mission will start and uh, yeah 500 kill for that is pretty cool in my opinion uh, another cosmetic hat we get is the mfg 9 helmet It's very similar to the other one uh, the ears are red instead of black and there's a like a nine with the the bar between the eyes so i think it's cool they did that a little variant of the previous one now we get two different camo paints you get five cans of the two different camos i'm not gonna show you guys you guys can look at it later but they are really really cool now at the bottom you got two stickers i'm not gonna show them because you guys will discover later but two nice stickers that will be rare in the future because it's special event stickers so i know some guys collect stickers and i know these stickers uh, because of the black and yellow they look really good in some uh, swags that i've seen today uh, another mission gave you fame when you get level 20 and the last one is the legendary auto rifle the mfg gen 9 and if you compare the stats to the faraday you will see it's very similar so I equipped the Faraday just to show you, but it's the same damage as the Faraday, but it's got more bullets in the clip. The rest is a bit lower. Uh, accuracy and range is almost the same, but the fire rate, like 45 lower. Faraday is 400, I think. Yeah, 400. And this one's 355. So I know the Faraday is very popular in PvP. It's probably top two legendary ARs in the game. So I cannot wait to see how the PvP guys like the new MFG Gen 9 because it's got the same damage, but it's got more bullet, similar range, similar accuracy. But how they like the lower fire rate, I guess we'll have to see in a few weeks what the comments are. But so far, I think it's really cool. I will leave you guys with some gameplay because again, the model is unique. I've never seen an auto rifle with a scope like that. It's pretty sick. So enjoy the gameplay guys, enjoy the event, it's gonna last for two weeks. And one last time, I got a lot of gold for you guys in the next two weeks. I got 10 codes of a thousand gold each, so make sure you check the Twitter, the Facebook, and watch the video I posted on YouTube yesterday for all the details how you guys can get free gold during the event. So thank you guys for watching, I will see you guys soon, take care. Bring it on!
Extraction unit to SG. Coming in moment, fast for hostile extraction. Be ready, sir.